I am here to do my Luna collection because those were the winners of last week's poll. Yes, all right. And as you might know, there will be no new poll this week because all of the ones that is going up in December will be from previous polls and requests. So I'm still counting those, but yeah, you'll see in December which ones they are. All right. So, let's get started with my Luna collection. So, I have their first single. For these, I bought usually, yeah, for all, pretty much I bought one edition of each of their releases, but then I bought the one which I pretty much like the cover the most of, so. Oh, she's so gorgeous, oh my gosh. It was quite the, I really like the concept, how they released and how all of them were the same design. It's a really, nice packaging even though as always I harp about you know it not being sewn but <laughs> other than that I do like the packaging for these albums so first single and then we have the second single again oh, this is such a gorgeous cover mm. so so pretty third single and here I bought as you can see all three of them so pretty, pretty, pretty covers and always pretty, pretty photo books. I mean, ooh. sorry, it was just one of these. Jumped out. Uh, just, just love their photo books so much. Oh, mm. all right. And then we have the fourth single. Uh, again, I love these uh, with the scenario when it's outside. Always did that. The natural lighting and just. I don't know, it's always been my favorite types of photo shoots. And then we have their first mini album, Love and Live. And then, oh, sixth single, no, fifth single. I'm not going to get confused by these. It's just sixth release, but it is the fifth single. So, let's see if I can keep my tongue straight. Oh, again, so pretty. Mm. And then the first mini album repackage, Love and Evil. I, even though it's a bit of a bummer since I can't put these together because I sort mine by color, I still do love how they have the same design. Uh, but then I would have to buy you know, the normal editions and I'm a sucker for limited editions so. <laughs> And then we have, let's see, we have their sixth single. <laughs> uh, and then their seventh single, also my favorite member. I know some people do ask who's my favorite, but here you go. And then we have their eighth single. Sorry, just need to think for a moment there. Need to say it the right way. Oh, so pretty, oh my gosh. Mm. And then their second mini album, Mix and Match, again limited edition. And then their second album, Repackage, Max and Match. Yeah, Max and Match. Mm, that's what it says right here. <laughs> Odd Eye Circle. Yeah, I probably should say what they're called. Since the subgroups do have names. <laughs> and then. We're on the ninth single now, right? Are we eighth? Yeah, ninth. Ninth single. Oh, <laughs> wrong way. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh gosh. And then we have the tenth single. This is one of my favorite covers. Even though all of the covers are really pretty. Again. <laughs> um, she's just so adorable here. Mm. Looks like something from almost back in time, you know, the 50s or, I don't know, it's really cute. Mm -hmm. Then the 11th single, Ooh. and then the 12th one, Ooh. again, so pretty. And then their 17th release, but their third mini album. Beauty and the Beat, mm. 
again with the subgroup so I guess when talking like that it would be this subgroup's first mini album release but for Luna as a group it is the third mini album yes and of course the limited edition yes and then I don't have more of their newer releases if you want to know why I'll just link the video where I talk about that yet if you haven't seen it mm. all right so that was it and there will be a new collection video up next week yes next weekend mm. all right thank you so so much for watching I do hope you enjoyed bye